Hey, what's up guys? You're watching Crypto Hustle and my name is Gray BTC. In this video, I will be reviewing a new metaverse project that some of you probably haven't heard, but it has been making some noise in the land or NFT land metaverse market. And this project name is Mars 4. Let's become Martians by owning some land in the metaverse on Mars 4. So this is a review video. And it's not an endorsement. Nothing that I mention in my videos should be considered financial advice whatsoever. This is for entertainment and education purposes only. So let's have fun and figure out what Mars 4 is really all about, guys. All right. So this is a website. It's Mars4.me. Mars 4 is a unique metaverse with a virtual reality component. The Mars 4 Project's development team has modeled their detailed 3D map of Mars terrain after NASA's Mars data. Think of it as a Mars equivalent of the 2001 Google Earth 3D map. Uh, in this virtual world on Mars, users purchase plots of land that they can later navigate build upon and monetize monetize okay so this is uh they're saying it's the first revenue generating nft in the universe okay and there is 19 99,888 mars nft land and there's 4 billion total mars 4 i think this is their token so i checked out their token over here this is what it looks like currently uh it's launched already and uh, these are the tokenomics, total supply of 4 billion, as we could see, and only, uh, but only 879 milli in circulating supply. And there is Mars Land NFT boat. So 56,343 has been bought already. So wow, it's moving really fast. So 56,000 of 99,000. Pretty intense, guys. I think. A lot of people are really getting into land ownership right now in crypto. So um, to me, this is quite interesting because uh, the, the concept of, of um, Mars, for example, is something that a lot of people are already excited about because of, you know, Elon Musk and what SpaceX has been doing. And as uh, uh, people on Earth has been obsessed with land, I mean, with the uh, uh, um, with Mars for a long time. So it says, own a unique piece of land on Mars, the fourth planet from the sun, as terraforming progress, more and more people will immigrate from Earth to live on the planet. So it seems like it's, it has a game to it, because if I watch this video here, which is sort of their premiere video, I mean, the intro video, and it, it's kind of, it has a storyline of like, okay, Earth is getting ripped off. So now people are uh, sort of switching moving over to Mars and you can be one of the first people to own a land to a piece of land But obviously the metaverse version of Mars um, So there is uh, you own a piece of land on Mars and There's also play to earn metaverse with play to earn feature is coming soon and you can monetize Choose your favorite spot and let it generate passive income and the token here has dual token economics, limited supply of 99,000, 99, uh, triple eight, unique land plots represented with NFTs. And one NFT means uh, is equal to one equal piece of land on Mars. You can purchase plots with Mars token and you can get the Mars token uh, if you want to purchase the land on Bittrex, SushiSwap. Oh, it's already listed on Bittrex, actually. Uh, SushiSwap and uh, MEM. Mex Global, Mexi Global. All right, and these are the tokenomics. Private round was 25%, community round, launch pads only got 1%, public rounds 5%, liquidity yield farming 30%. Okay, that's reasonable. And team of advisors 20%. Okay, let's look at who these advisors are. All right. Um, oh, wow, they have a lot of believers, sort of the partners. Olivium, Bitcoin.com, AU21 Capital, State Capital, Tensor Capital. Wow, it's a lot of um, people. So, latest. Uh, okay, so this is the team. Yeah, let's see. Okay, so the team, um, the core team is world class, coming from companies like PwC, LinkedIn, Salesforce, Swedbank. And one of the team members helped build and launch the first marketplace 
on Second Life, the original metaverse. In addition, similar to um, they have investors in Bitcoin, Ethereum and newer decentralized startups. So it seems like it's a very solid team because I think Bitrix uh, is involved with these guys. That's probably why they listed them super early. Uh, oh, OKX Blockchain Ventures. OK, so th this is nice. Good sign that there is a lot of big names on here that are already involved in the project. That's why it got listed already on Bitrix. And you guys know how how Bitrix is picky when it comes to uh, listing tokens on their platform. And Masfo has an allocation of triple eight rare or super rare NFTs. Uh, these will only be sold on auctions, which you can get to know by subscribing to their Martian Times newsletter, which is their newsletter. Uh, if you want to be part of it, you can um, subscribe to it. These rare NFTs are categorized according to land features. For example, you can find craters or mountains. Uh, and March 4 has a, two huge valleys named Unicorn and Crypto. Around them, you can find rare NFTs with names of projects or influences in the uh, cryptocurrency world. So let's see if you say explore Mars. Here you can just buy the land. So I mean, you know, it, it, right now the strategy is this, guys. Depending on what you're into right now, if you're a token guy, you can simply just buy coins or tokens of projects like this and keep them because if the project becomes successful, the token itself also stands a chance. Uh, but if you want to take things to the next level, you find a metaverse project that you like and you own some land. Oh wow! So most of it is actually owned already. Well, not not all of it, but yeah, a good a good amount of it. I would want to own a crater, to be honest. I like craters. Let's see if this crater is owned. Land plots. Oh no, March 4. Okay, so this one is still there. Arago. Okay, so Henry, Caleb, Sebastian, Levi. Are these people who own? Yeah, so I think the ones in red are already owned by someone else. Oops, okay. The ones that are open, uh, the ones here, the craters, I think they're not sold yet because they're still owned by Mars 4 itself. Okay, so let's say if you had to want to buy this land plot, add to cart. Okay, so, so a, a, a one single Greed is being sold for a square is being sold for 0 0.177 Ethereum, which is 27,284 Mars 4 tokens. Oh la la, interesting. Which again, you can buy on uh, Sushi Swap and Bitrix Global. All right, so you guys, let me know what you think. If you end up buying some land on here, I would like to know which one have you bought. Um, and how many do you own and why? Um, or also generally, what do you think about this project? Uh, in general, do you think this is uh, going to break out as a big metaverse project? Or it's just one of those? I would definitely like to hear uh, your thoughts on this. But it's interesting where things are going right now in the metaverse. And if you're wondering how does uh, NFTs generate revenue in this ecosystem, before the launch of the metaverse, epochs were introduced to... Uh, redistribute passive income for Mars landlords. Each epoch starts uh, after a new 10,000 NFTs are sold. Price of the NFTs increases for each epoch. So from like zero to one to two, there's a price difference from there. So if you um, if you got a distribution on zero and one, it means by two, by the epoch two, you will already be incentivized because the prices will be a lot higher. So that's pretty much how it works. You should just look into it. There is the e-commerce side of it. And this is a community project as well. Uh, there are more than 5,000 Mars landlords so far and more than 110,000 Martians across all social media channels. Uh, I'm interested to see how this is going to, um, to grow and turn into something. But I also want to hear your thoughts in the comments, guys. Thank you for watching and I'll see you on the moon as always. Peace.